Yeah, buddy. Shade 405 SMS Radio. The whole team, we're here chilling, hanging out with you guys. Yes. Yeah. Sure we have our ready. second guest in the building, man. Mm-mm. Hey, hi, how you doing, sir? Peace to the world. I love every one of you. <laughs> we have Young Dirty it. Bastard in the building. Is that what you go about? You go about Young Dirty Bastard and all that. I hear the claps, God damn it. Okay. Yeah, yeah, Young Dirty Bastard, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? That's me, and then I'm under the radar. I should be under the weather, too. And I love every one of you. Let's keep if, it going. If you put the headphones on, you can it's hear us well. It's too loud. You sound like Dre. These are Dre's? Yeah. Little feedback, it'll feedback if you don't put them on. Damn shits, but I want an endorsement from you. Okay. <laughs> so, um, yeah, we got... <laughs> we have Young Dirty Bastard in the building. Yes. So many questions. Well, uh, <laughs> not even... Uh, how about I'm so impressed huh. with going to Summer Jam last week. Yeah. Of course, you know, for me, it was all about the Wu-Tang. And right Old Dirty's record comes on, and his son just jumps out. Yeah. Nobody look, was yo, expecting bro, that. You look just like your father, B. Peace. You I had the braids. Either, no, no. Right. You had the braids, everything going. You had the whole look. I, I swear to God, I'm like, yo, Thank what you. the fuck just happened here? Yeah. And then people was like, yo, that's his son. That's yeah. his son. So it was... How was that experience Big, for you jumping man. on that stage? On for Sunday? me, I had to do that because my mama said do it. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> she was at she always in Georgia, like you got to make the money. So that was my, I had to seize the moment and I did it. You know what I'm saying? Okay. It's like an Ali moment. That's what I, I needed. That right, I really right. Needed that. <laughs> was that something planned beforehand, like with the rest of the that members? That was never planned. <laughs> oh, that was just you deep you know, over the just stage. You know, up. Joker said that there's not really a plan with this. We're just gonna do it high. You know, it's going it's going it's gonna happen. Right. And when it happens, it's gonna be crazy. Okay. And and you know just following the footsteps of what your father has done in this game mm. and what he did, uh, it was amazing. Just like when he did the Grammy, when he walked out in the Grammy <laughs> and grabbed the mic from <laughs> somebody, it was like Wu Tang. You know, Puffy cool, but Wu Tang for the children. Yeah, and he was dressed. Wu Tang is the best. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's crazy, yeah. bro. You, do you follow a lot of the shit that he did? Uh, I, it's hard to follow something like that. You know what I'm saying? You no, but I'm just, I, like, have you ever saw everything? Like, no such thing as a follower. You know what I'm saying? Right. It's basically the, actually the best leader is a follower. You know what I'm saying? But all I did was just be him, and I came out of the sperm, and I didn't do nothing <laughs> better than that. Right. That's all I can do is to be me. So how old are you right now? I'm 24. Wisdom 24. culture. 24 yeah. years old Wow And for how long You been doing the rap thing I've been doing the rap thing For as long as I have hair on my nuts And I, I'm not sure Because I've never checked So how long has that been <laughs> My mom been checking A long time either. <laughs> So how about uh, Just give us a figure For how long you been doing it I've been doing it Since 9 years old When I hit the okay. Apollo With my pops Nice And I did a little Harlem shake on the stage you I, know I had saying? hair on my nuts At 11 so Okay guys <laughs> TMI KG do you want to share He beat me <laughs> I don't remember. I think I was 10. I'll go, I'll go in the middle of the road. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, guys. I'm moving along from the nut convo. Okay. So, she yeah. met, but she ain't got it. <laughs> so, I understand. Yeah, I mean, I'm hating. No, no, so, we love the woman. Okay, thank you. Hope so. So, it. you've been doing your thing since the age of nine, hitting the stage with your dad. Yeah. That was a monumental moment, and you've been doing it ever since. I've been seeing some of the videos that you have on the web. Definitely, you embody the energy that your father had. Yeah, I have it somewhat what under control. You have it under yeah. control. <laughs> yeah, is it, is it hard to do that to keep it on the on the wraps? Well, it's hard to keep <laughs> your your life under control right now. Right. Yeah, the way cool. the game is going, not just the rap, it's the world. Mm-hmm. People and what Santa Monica shooting people and it's, the world is crazy. Mm. To keep oneself under control is a very difficult task. Right. That's yeah. real. That's I mean, no, he's talking real shit. Wait, wait, are you born and raised in New York City? Or? Yeah, I was born in Brooklyn. Okay. Methodist Hospital, baby. <laughs> yeah. And where you live now? You still live in Brooklyn? I live in Georgia, but, you know, I had two babies out there. They're oh, beautiful, beautiful organic creatures. <laughs> 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 but I want to come back and live here, you know what I'm saying? Okay. You want to come back to New York? Yeah. I, well, I, I'm hearing you're getting ready to do big things with the, with a big tour with the whole entire Wu-Tang. Yeah, 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 yeah. A lot of big things coming. Young Dirty Bastard got his own tour coming, too. Okay. okay. You know, Wu-Tang Clan, I might just pop up on that, you know what I'm saying? Right. How I do. And basically, well, I got a lot of stuff coming. All right, well, we're going to talk about right. it. So yeah. listen, we were just talking about your whole Wu-Tang um, Clan performance. What else can we expect to see you on any stages this summer? I know you got a lot going on, so what are you doing? Yes, I have a lot going on, <laughs> and you can see me on the Rock the Bells coming to a nice. theater near you. For real, <laughs> Rock the Bells is always a great, um, you know, a great a outlet for real hip hop fans. It's a great, you know what I'm saying? Fans. So you're gonna be performing on your very own, your own thing, doing your yeah, own thing. Yeah, do my own thing, and always my father's thing. Nice. You know? it, it's it has to happen like that. If I don't <laughs> carry his sword, then who else will? 
Right. I mean, it's interesting that you say that because we just had Chris Rivers up here, Big Pun's son, and he's kind of like not trying to stray away, but he he's kind of separating himself from his mm-hmm. father's legacy. You know, he doesn't want he wants to be considered an individual. And you, on the other hand, you kind of embody your father, like you know what I'm saying. Yeah, so, yeah. I mean, why why do you feel to do? You I don't think. Do that? I mean, it's to separate yourself from what everybody already knows mm-hmm. where you come from. It's your lineage. It's your lineage. Like, why would you try to run from that? We are prince, um, we are kings, but we have to understand it's a legacy, mm-hmm. and the, we're not going to let that die out. You know what I'm saying? In order to build the legacy, it comes from great power. Right. You know what I'm saying? And this is something I'm going to make everybody know that I'm a fulfill. Mm-hmm. The reality show. Come he on. has a reality show? Yes, uh, oh. Hold up a minute. Who, who told you that? <laughs> Wait a minute. You have a reality show? Yes, I do. My Lord. Where are we going to see this? And when are we going to see this? Well, it's coming It's coming real soon. You know, it's VH1. Oh, okay. Yeah. VH1. And what is it, what is it based is it, on? Is it all around you? Uh, It's all around me. No, no, no. It's, uh, <laughs> everything surrounds me. You know, I'm the son of the universe. But uh, I have a mother. I have a, a sister. I have brothers and grandmas and grandpas and we all live in the same house i have an uncle that lives there it's a bunch of crazy shit (laughs) and we're gonna get to see all of that (laughs) yeah everybody got their own character you know what i'm saying it's 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 you want to it's some crazy i don't know how to direct this this question or this answer (laughs) have you already started shooting i just know it's gonna be cool it's gonna be a definitely and we (laughs) we definitely started shooting you know what i'm saying okay I never did nothing like that, so you know I'm not really a TV person. But this one uh, is worth the money. Uh, did they catch you doing anything scandalous? Yeah, I peed on my dog. What? <laughs> <laughs> Rewind, <laughs> sir. What are you talking about? <laughs> no, nah, I'm playing with oh, you. Oh, all about to say what? <laughs> we got to see. We get to see you peeing on your big dog. family <laughs> reality show on the way. Um, Mixtape. Yeah, he oh, has yeah. a brand new mixtape out. What's yeah, the name yeah. of that? Brand new mixtape out. Yo, go get that food stamp. Full Stamp Celebrity, Volume 1. You know what I'm saying? I love it. DJ Absolute, shout out to him. You know, he's, he's, he's definitely he's young, he's a representative of all of us. Food Stamp Celebrity. Okay. Yeah. Well, listen, Um, a few uh, months ago, we had Michael K. Williams. Remember, mm-hmm. he was up here, and he was talking to us about... From The Wire. From The Wire, okay, okay. Michael K. Williams. He's supposedly playing your dad. I did not authorize that. <laughs> And that is not authentic. We, I mean, we we're going to get to it. So supposedly there's this movie being made yeah. about your father. So obviously you're, you're not co-signing that. No, definitely not. I don't know I anything about it. I think he said, it. Uh, he th- he said o, um, ODB's mom's, your grandmother. I love my grandma. Yeah. I think he said that she has something to do with producing it and stuff like that. Yeah. So. Well, it was one of his um, old managers supposedly that's putting it that together. Too, yeah. ODB's I hope it's manager. not Jared. I don't know who, little but it was rat. one of his. Uh oh, <laughs> was that well, that's, that was the white boy? <laughs> little rat. <laughs> uh oh, some pent up tension there. Yeah. So what's going on? When you heard about this movie being made, what were your thoughts? Well, I wanted to choke him. You know, I wanted to choke everybody on the set. But I think if they want to make a movie and not tell us about it, especially the estate, that's what's that's called an infringement. You know what I'm saying? They definitely need to come to me or to my mother, Isolene Jones, the administrator of the estate. Right. Okay. You know, they got to tell somebody something. Mm-hmm. They messing with big money. You know, right. what do people do about big money? I'm not talking about mafia. CCF, baby. Cuffy Crown family. Sorry, they that came out of nowhere. Did shit. they not reach out to you guys at <laughs> yeah. all? No, nah, they didn't say nothing to us. Everything they do that you see on that's televised, they don't tell me. Mm. Anything you see. Trust me, anything you see. So now that you know that the movie is, you know what I'm saying, in the works, the wheel's already moving on that, did you guys at all try to put a stop to it? Or did you guys, you know, yeah, speak we, on it? We try to put a stop to it. We sent some paperwork over there. They they, they got a little quiet, you know what I'm saying? Mm. Right. Well, they, they, they might have... Rizzo got something that's about to be in the works next week. A project? Yeah. It's okay. going to be dope. It's going to be dope. And when can we expect that? Next week. Oh, next week. We're going to push it again. I thought he said they're going to start working <laughs> we on it next look. week. We're going to get do it. it next week and try to do it and put it out next week. <laughs> All at the same time. Yeah, 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 so, yeah. listen, um, a lot of people were talking like when they heard that the Wu was doing their 20 year anniversary at mm-hmm. Summer Jam, it was like, yo, possibly, maybe a hologram is this going to happen. But there's been a lot of talks of possibly a hologram coming out at another, you know, venue. Okay. Is. Have you heard anything about of your father, obviously? Have you heard any of this? Tell me everything you know. Honey. No, I don't know. We want to hear from you. What other venue? I don't know. It's, Supposedly there's another... Isn't big... it for um, what we just talked about? Rock the Bells? Yeah. I'm about to say. Who yeah, else yeah. I got to <laughs> No. <laughs> he said, who else I got to... <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah.
Already Why have a thing? hologram when we got a sun right you there in the already flesh? No, you know, I don't know. These guys like the new world. Right. You know, I mean, it's, it's technology. I'm just saying, would, would you be opposed to that? Now, about the hologram, you know, we're still working out the paperwork with that. You know what I'm saying? Also, it's a possibility. Yeah, it's a possibility, but I don't really like the hologram. Yeah, I was just going to how do you feel about that? <laughs> uh, I felt that uh, I'm already here. You know what I'm saying? Why have some little computer hologram try to beat me you wouldn't think it would be ill to have you know you still come out but your dad you know well the hologram of your father and you perform now that's not doesn't seem ill to you <laughs> you're, not, you're not interested i don't i'm just saying visually <laughs> i'm saying visually it could be ill do you not see that i like to see movies in the movie theaters too <laughs> All right, <laughs> guys, help me. What? Like, do you? Do you I'm, lo- I'm loving well, well, his well, answers. Well, well Easy E is gonna be on there. Would you rather see him next to you? I'd rather play I, ODB's part. I, I'd rather right, be up saying. there, up there with Easy E. You know what I'm saying? Oh, word. Okay. Then, then myself. Because those know, two so. are the two holograms they're supposed to be putting up. Yeah, there. that's what I'm saying. So you're like, eh, whatever about it. I don't really care about it. <laughs> outside, let me ask you. Outside of the Wu Tang, who do you listen to? Outside of the Wu Tang, who do I listen to? Yeah. Pat Post, you know. Okay. Shout out to you. Alphabetical <laughs> slaughter. He just shut down Summer Jam, baby. Face, face, face. Alphabetical slaughter. Yes, Did you I see did. him there, at Summer Jam? I only see myself. I wish I caught him. <laughs> All right. I got. I just made it on the stage, baby. Nah, he, listen. He Shit. came and closed the show, bro. Damn. He is one of my favorite artists. That's what's okay. up, man. Yeah. Pat also, Pulse. you know, shout out to Rock Kim and his son. Absolutely. You know what I'm saying? They, they basically though. You already know. Mm-hmm. God MC Peace to that That's Yeah I, de- I just performed With Rock Kim the other day yeah. We're in Brooklyn right? Yeah they yeah. just had a Red festival Hulk, Red yeah. Hulk. yeah that was cool <laughs> Well listen we all, Anytime we got a guest Come up here Especially if they're A new artist Or you know what I'm saying They trying to get exposed Or just First time up here We have them freestyle You open for that? No I'm not You're not? No cause everybody else do it What? So he's I declining like The freestyle I even know Fine. Cause I just played a song for you You got that for the free you know, oh. you well, know we gotta wait because it's gonna make a dollar off of that. Yeah. And, oh. you, and they want a freestyle. Oh, okay. So we got a <laughs> pace for the freestyle. God oh. damn it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. I know artists and R and B singers that freestyle. And I done never heard Michael Jackson freestyle in my life. Me either. But except when he moonwalked on the stage. Yeah. That's what I'm about. I'm trying to move to the next level of my life. Okay. It's I'm I'm on some Denzel baby. <laughs> Whatever that and means. You don't see him freestyling movies. He he act out the whole thing from a written script, baby. Right. Let's take it to the next level and get real money. I feel you, man. Peace. All right. <laughs> I'm loving this fucking guy. Oh, right here, is... Hey, we still on? All right. Yeah, we still on. Yo, tell Dame Dash huh? I'm looking for him, and I want those masters back right now. Whoa. You know what I'm saying? Because we've been we well, why we gotta go through the courts when we could do this man to man? We need to build about it and get this thing right. He got my father's songs, and I want it back. For real? Yeah. Yeah, because he was he was signed to Rockefeller. Oh, be, oh, yeah. Why but... is he still holding on to your father's stuff? Ask that man. Well, he's not here. Do you? Why? Well, I'm asking you. I heard he's in Soho. Right. He has a boutique or like that, right? A little, I don't know. <laughs> no, he does. I already did. He, he did have a boutique. I'm no, not but, lying. No, no, but this is real shit. Your father was signed to Rockefeller. He had a lot Please. of music yeah. put together before yeah, he passed away. A nice size album. And I want it. You know what I'm saying? Have I, you approached him about it? Uh, It's just, I heard he's been on a run. Oh, he's hard to get in contact yeah, with. Now I know he's in Soho. Right. You gotta run up in that boutique. I out, if I was y'all, camp out right in front of his store. Oh, <laughs> like, what's really good, <laughs> homie? To me, somebody camped out there. You know what I'm saying? You you could get you could get a freestyle later. Like, you know, what I'm I don't want to do that shit. You good? Don't worry about it. it I like you and all that. I, I like you too. That's you know why we're not gonna push it. All right, don't Please. worry about it. So that's his music. And Dame Dash, you got one coming to you. <laughs> Yo, too. Yeah, Dame, Dame Dash, Dash you get a freestyle. We looking for you. <laughs> <laughs> Give him a freestyle with a skateboard up beside his head. My lord. <laughs> you know what I'm Oh my yeah. goodness! So listen, so you have um, a brand new mixtape out that it will be soon available to the public. Yes, peace. And you got brand new music that you let us play for you. Thank you. Um, you know, play for the public. And also, we can see you at Rock the Bells coming up. Mm-hmm. And you yes. said, what else you have else coming up? Uh, uh, reality show. Reality, reality yeah, that's show. real. Big on BH1. Right What's the name of it, by the way? Uh, we playing around with these titles. It might be the house that Dirty built. Oh, nice. Mm. That's yeah. actually cool. That's kind of dope. That is dope. That is dope. Thank you. And so listen, uh, where can the public follow you and you know keep up with you and talk to yeah. you and all that? Yo, catch me on YDB YDB seven, YDB YDB Twitter, YDB YDB Facebook. Uh, do you have Instagram or not? 
I have an Instagram and it's YDB. YDB. Okay. All right, YDB, YDB. Young Dirty Bastard, thank you for coming through. Yeah.